Hi there viewers at home, welcome to Music Revolution Nigeria. Of course, they will be having a very important guest in the building. So let's get to meet you. Hello there. Hello everybody, my name is Jamie. It's crazy as you all know. Here my crown now, take over crown now, give me a crown now, back to back. Man, your, your intro is really like off the hook. I didn't really get to <laughs> have a particular stuff I could call you. You keep saying crown now, crown now, crown now. Which of the crown are we talking about now? Just any way you can do it. Once you know my song, just give me the crown of the song. It's all right. <laughs> okay, that's a nice one. So tell us, how long have you been doing the music now? How long have you been doing music officially? Officially, I've been doing music for three years. Yeah, okay. But casually, I've been playing around live band. And um, most of the time, I play drums. Play drums. Out, you know, so. That means um, literally you're very good with the sticks. Yeah. Oh, that's a nice to some one. extent. To some extent, that's a nice one. So tell us, how has it been for you so far in the music industry? Has it been very easy or difficult? What can you say for yourself? I actually didn't do music because a lot of people are doing it. Or I see from it's what I do that I enjoy doing that makes me happy. So practically, I just enjoy doing music. So the only aspect of the challenges I'm having is when it comes to the promo where you have to use form and which that is part of life. Yeah, definitely. So if somebody is working for you and the person is not getting anything, it's not going anywhere because it's not improving. So I believe whatever has been happening in the industry about fun, especially in this country, okay. I don't see it as a big deal. You understand? But I just it is just what you can afford and with God, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. things can actually fast. get easy. Of course. Mm -hmm. Okay, so definitely now you tell us what kind of genre of music you do. If I'm to ask you now, what kind of genre of music you do? Is it actually uh, when I was doing music, the way I started playing drums, going okay. to live band, leading and all that, I was able to infuse myself in any kind of sound, high life, okay. hip hop, afro, uh, you know that. So like baby Soke is kind of a will okay. dance or and I have take over with a UK vibe and I have Evima which is the Nigeria dance all time. So actually I can actually flip around. around. So I don't really, I just believe in good music. Good. Yeah. Okay. So do you have a particular banger now that I would say like a particular song that is trending, mm. that's on the airways, probably with social media or the radio or TV or something. You have a particular one? Yeah, actually um Irima is going on air, Irima is on MTV Sound City. Good. And you shot a video for it already? Yeah, I shot a video for it. Dropped about two months ago. So social media and everywhere. Then I dropped an EP that comes ten tunes, three songs, every mark, then it's okay and take over. So everything is working well and I'm about to drop go on my next project. By the end of this month we'll shoot my next video. So now particularly like once you look at the music industry, yeah. which particular art would you say it's your uh, in, that influences the kind of music you do? Like right now, basically everybody, everybody has been trying, you've been working years, I've been seeing that. But there's still one person that still capture mm -hmm. my heart when I'm going, when I hear him, I yeah. want to say, okay, what is he trying to say? And that is vulnerable. Vulnerable? Yeah. So you like the kind of music you do? Yeah, I like, I like his vibe. I like the energy, mm -hmm. I like the strength, I like the attitude, I like being well, and that guy is well. So I you look well, though. <laughs> but I love the hairstyle, so it's classy. <laughs> Thank you. So, okay. So now let's look at this from this aspect. A couple of years from now, probably next two to three years, what should we expect in from you? A big deal that you give us, like if you want to talk to your viewers or your fans. Well, right now, keep expecting. I'm on the African Boy Empire. Okay. You have a record deal already? Yeah. Well, that's nice. As a label. So, I think we're working and we're working and I promise all my fans, I promise to keep giving the best and the best. You don't want to get my sound and you'll be like, why is it going down? No, it just has to be it. Okay. So that is the only thing I'm focusing on. So to all my fans around the world, Instagram, Facebook, everywhere, Sound City, everywhere. Sell I really out. Sell out. Okay, now let me just give this platform. You can also tell us a social media handle so your fans get to know. Your Twitter, yeah? Yeah, my Twitter is RabzG. Okay, yeah. Instagram and Instagram is official G underscore W I N Z. Okay. Crazy. 
which is the crazy shibri K R A W Z Y. That's nice one. Uh, Facebook, Facebook. Okay. G W I N Z, and we still have the crazy. You heard it already from him. This is one of the um, potential as the report in the building. He has told us everything about him, and of course, he has a nice music video already trending on Sound City. Yeah. yeah. Good. That's a nice one. Uh, you still on to Music Revolution Nigeria? Of course, you can follow us on Twitter, Music Revolution Nigeria. You can follow us on Instagram, Music Revolution Nigeria, and of course, Facebook too, Music Revolution Nigeria. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel, Music Revolution Nigeria. Once again, I'm your favorite OAP VJ Imano. Thank you, bro, for having you. God bless, my one love, man. Of course, we're here to talk about upcoming stars and should I say stars who are already in the uh, industry. We'll be right back. I've got a very important guest in the studio, someone who's been very potential in the industry. So let me not say much about him. Let me get to meet you. Yes, my name is Deril Don Classic DDC. Deril Don Classic DDC. Yes, I'll stick to Don Classic. I love that Don. <laughs> I hope you have a lot of money to spend to us today. Okay, Deril, I, I was told that you went for US tour. You have a new video that's trending right now. So can you tell us more about it? Um, Actually, I went to like um, four or five um, cities. Wow. In the US? In the US. Wow, I that's went cool. to New York. New York, cool. Uh, Philadelphia. Philly, nice one. Uh, at, uh, Atlanta, Atlanta. Chicago. Chicago. And then um, I, I supposed to go to Boston. I had to cancel it. So, uh, so um, it was a very nice uh, trip. Okay. And then um, I really finally came back to New York again. And, you know, shot, shot the video. video before I started to come yeah. back. Okay, actually I saw the video myself, it was really classy and dope. Uh, nice one, man, I gotta give it some stuff, but I deserve a lot of accolades. So now tell us now, how long have you been doing music professionally? Ah, if I tell you how long I've started, you'll be shocked. Really? I love yeah, to know, yes. I'm curious. I've been, a, uh, I've been a technocrat for, you know, almost two decades in my life. Wow. And uh, when I left the banking industry, yeah. uh, I just, you know, I didn't spend more than one month before I started to realize that I have something that yes. is different from what I've been doing. You know, and that is music. So I came, it, it, music came like a, a kind of um, call, a divine call. Okay. And I, when I saw the potential that I had, mm -hmm. then, you know, it was massive. And I said, no, I have to listen to that voice. Good. Irrespective yeah. of the age or whatever, no, no, that should not be. We are talking about entertainment, mm -hmm. and um, I said, no, let me. Whatever I started to do in my life, okay, I like to do, do you know, to do the, to do its best. Okay, okay. So, by and large, I've been in the industry for just two years. Okay, okay, that's good. So now, looking at the fact that you've been in the industry for just two years, what kind of genre of music do you do? Can you tell your viewers out there? Yeah, I do Afro, Afro pop, I do R&B, and, um, uh, and even uh, hip hop. Hip hop? Trap. Okay, that means you can rap, like yeah, literally. I, I do, I do okay, rap. that's a nice one. I love to see you rap someday. Thank you. All right, uh, <laughs> so let's go on to the next question now. Um, actually, in Nigeria now, who can you categorically say that would be uh, the person you love to have a collaboration with? You understand? Looking at the kind of dope video you did already, I love the video for what it's worth. It's yeah, a nice so one. So who would you like to collaborate with? When you want to collaborate with uh, anyone, I mean, in okay. particular, you know, general video, you have yes. to look at someone who has that kind of pattern. Yes, true. Okay, we look at that song, okay? Mm -hmm. You say, make a new you can do for you. You know, you find that yeah. like someone like, like Run Town. Okay. You know, yeah. someone like Desi Do. Davido. You yeah, know, cool. so especially those two guys, I really pencil for that. Okay. Uh, and even YC can also do very well there too. So um, I'm, I'm really looking forward to one of those three guys. If you want to tell your viewers something at home now, let's just say that a couple of years from now, probably in the last two to three years, what major project you will be expecting from you, don't say? Uh, yeah, um, the major project I'm expecting is to you know, come to the Lagan society. Okay. You know, I've, you know, for almost, for just those uh, two years now, mm -hmm. I've done more, close to 140 tracks. Wow. So just to corroborate my former assertion, mm -hmm. that is a call. The call, yes. So it's just to tell you that it is, is a call. It's not something that I just, I'm just trying to crack mm -hmm. my head. So, yes, yeah, that's true. And um, so I want to launch it. I want to, I want the world, not only Nigeria, I want mm -hmm. Africa to know that there is yes. someone 
you know, who has defied the thought of mm -hmm. age mm -hmm. to produce yeah. one of the best R&B, mm -hmm. one of the best hip hops. Okay. Okay. In the highly competitive Nigerian environment. Mm -hmm. Good. And also who can stand the test of time. Mm -hmm. But the kind of music I wouldn't literally say is just Nigeria. You've gone international already. Absolutely. Yes, for it to have gone to Philly, New York, Chicago, to mention but a few, to do that kind of nice video, trust me, Thank your song you. is going global. Viewers at home, you heard it from Don C. He's one of our important guests here in the house who has done a very wonderful music. I saw his music video, it was really good. Did it was you? awesome. Uh, thank you very much, sir. Thank you. Thank you. I think that's all for now. It's a nice one. Thank you very thank much. You. I'm still your number one favorite OAP, VJ Emmanuel. And today we'll have a very beautiful, sexy, young, talented artist in the building. Actually, she's a female. So now let's get to meet her. Hello there. Hi. How are you? I'm good. Okay, let's get to meet you. I love your glasses. Thank you, I love you too. <laughs> so, uh, my name is Sinachi, I'm an Afro Pop Trop RB artist. Okay. Yeah, so I'm here to actually support the upcoming rising stars. Because we are stars. We are stars, yeah. definitely. Yeah. So, let me just ask a question Sinachi, is it, is it a short form of a particular name, or mm -hmm. is that just your name, or a stage name, it's or your real name? combination of my name, two of my names. Okay. Because okay. in form, that is um, the last letters of words of Justina, which is Tina, and the three letter words okay. of Chiamaka, which is Chiamaka. That's a nice one. I was about to go in there. That's a nice one. So Thank how long has it been for you in the music industry now? Um, Now it's two years. I've been Officially two years. Two years. Yeah, two years. Oh. Just clocked two years. Now. Just clocked two years. Yeah. And it's good. Good feels to see you. Good. It feels good too. Yeah, it does. That's a nice one. Yes. So tell us, how has it been for you in the music industry? What would you say about it? All this while you've been there. Um, I, I don't really like to use the word hard, but I like to use the word um, it has been very, very okay. It's been better because I try to tell people that if you refuse to look at the hardship and always be like you're so fighting that you can actually move forward you will move forward being hard is something that will actually move you forward like little drops of water makes a mighty ocean but at the same time yeah obstacles here and there but i'm grateful to god i actually passed that and mm -hmm. to find me who i am today okay that was a nice one so sinachina let me ask you what kind of genre of music you do afro pop stroke r and yeah. b song so so yeah. you don't rap you look like a rapper I do. You do, right? I just decided you my design was that Nikki Flows yeah. and Cardi B kind of flows and no, all that. No, no, I'm not a rapper. Just because, actually, I decided to just be all this look because my designers were like, just change your look today. I just okay. want you to just look a little bit of the gangster. Gangster. Like, gangster. Yeah, you look gangster. Yeah, you got a problem there. Okay, now, Sinash, let's ask you this uh, question now. Looking at the Nigerian music yeah. industry, who can you particularly say is your role model? Oh, that's very, very hard because I don't think I really actually have a role model. For, In Nigeria? Yeah, because everyone is good. Seriously, everyone is good. But well, actually, there should be music. one particular person that inspires uh, you big time to do music in Nigeria. Big time. Mm -hmm. uh, Just kill the bits. I love Yumi Alade, just like mm -hmm. her African style of music and the way okay. she carries herself and everything. The way she relates Africa and the way it owns to us and it's based okay. on the international part. Okay. But all the same, that's what you came in after. Yeah, You've not said the main, the that's what I want to hear. Fit. Oh god, they are much. <laughs> oh my. Yeah, much like yeah, crushing on everyone. Much, as in everybody with their own <laughs> style, seriously. Okay. But you have to be one time. Um, I love um, this kid because he's yeah, original. Yeah. He's, okay. There's something about him that just, when you listen to a beat, it just sparks it off. Okay. And I also love this particular person, Crystal Blaze. He's a rapper, okay. yes, he's a rapper, an upcoming uh, artist, he's a rapper, mm -hmm. and the way he handles things, he can go from Yoruba to Igbo, mm -hmm. all the same, and he sings it, it too, and he's a rapper. So well, all those type of things that can inspire me, let me know that, let me know that I can actually divide myself when it comes to things, you just have to say you can do it, and you will do it, that's, that's just nice it. One. Yeah. So Sinach, now, as a particular artist that you are, R&B yeah. and... Um, Afro pop, sorry. Right. So, do you have any particular instrument that you can play? Oh, I have two. Two, okay. Yeah, I have the guitar. You can play guitar very yeah. well. No, really. You can play to yourself. Yeah. Okay, I'm trying. I actually have a guitar at home, Definitely. and uh, I have a piano. The piano. Yes, I'm learning. So, guitar. Now I'm like. 
overboard more than 50 now, but I just want okay. to be really be good. So you can At easily least. compose a song yeah, with the guitar. Yeah, now. exactly. Yeah, so I want to be original with it. So what I've always wanted to do, just want to produce this kind of music that is different mm -hmm. in Nigeria. Mm -hmm. So I just want to do that first, learn that. Then you know, mostly in Nigeria, the kind of music we hear just bam, 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 bam. Yeah. bam. At the same time, people have not did the bam, bam, they make it feel like praise. You just have to just connect. We Nigerians, I know we did like the bam, bam, mm -hmm. but we do like lyrics that are very, very motivating too. Put a, if you have a lyrics that are motivating, everybody wants to be like something that would tinge your spirit. Ah, man, I love this. Mm -hmm. I can do with an neck or something like that. Mm -hmm. And also grieving. You no, know, the mm -hmm. wild problem is so much. When you do bang bang, mm -hmm. it's bang bang. Do do it. Okay, that's yeah. cool. Yeah. So now you can tell us now, let me ask you, in a couple of years from now, probably two years or three yeah. years from now, what should we be expecting from you as an artist, a major project or uh, a major collab? Beyond, because mm -hmm. um, my project right now is that I'm thinking that, yes, why don't we all also give room for upcoming artists? There are a lot of talented stars out there. There can be upcoming artists. Those who don't think we are all stars, why don't we just come together and try to make room mm -hmm. for upcoming artists? You know, stars, individuals, they have their own industry. Now, why can't we upcoming artists have our own industry? Yes, like, and call companies to come and invest and have all these select. Mm -hmm. We upcoming, we have to make a name for us. We don't have to be, I don't believe that you have to be for record labels so to come and stand there. Mm -hmm. You are your own record label. Mm -hmm. You just have to know what you want in life for you to get there. Mm -hmm. So that's actually my own plan. All right, guys, we heard it from Sina. She yeah. has given us a very important thing to put into consideration for upcoming artists in Nigeria. She, no, she didn't even give us your handle on social media. Okay, yeah, you can reach me on um, IG Tinachi1992, on Twitter Tinachi05, and on Facebook Tinachi. You just heard it. type and just, you you just come it. out. She's yeah. so beautiful. Thank you. you. <laughs> so you already have what we have to say to this yeah. now. Music Revolution Nigeria, we're going global. You already know what it is. Just, we have Tinachi here, yeah. of course. It's going to be the bomb. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing your favorite. OAP VJ Imano. Very energetic, young, talented um, artist in the house. Let's just to meet him. Hello there, how are you? Oh, I'm cool. If I will get to know you. Yeah, it's a boy, Crystal Blaze. Slow, slow, don't talk much. You know what? They look back, but tomorrow, you want to jump up. Really? Yeah. I didn't get to hear a thing you said. <laughs> <laughs> but that was a nice one, nice yeah. introduction actually. Yeah, so you actually a rapper or singer or what exactly do you do? Yeah, I'm a rapper, but uh, I can be versatile. Sometimes. Okay. Yeah. So how long has it been for you in the music industry? When did you start doing music wow. officially? I think 11 years ago though. You've been into music 11 years ago? So, yeah. Wow. Years ago. I started right from my um, secondary school day. Okay. I was thinking about it's like going for shows, it's like going for rap battles, okay. and, you know, all those things like that. Yeah. So I encourage myself and um, I've been to different uh, shows. Yeah, it's obvious. Even right before I left secondary school, and by God's grace, I've been creating ways for myself. Mm -hmm. I can, I can see the hashtag on your heart. <laughs> yeah. Jekomo. Jekomo. That's the club, bro. Jekomo. They will definitely yeah, know. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I love that. So now let's go on to the next question now. Uh, music industry for you, yeah. how has it been? Would you call it easy or difficult? What exactly would you say for yourself? Um, oh, wow. That question is very, very Definitely great now. Though. As someone who has been in the industry like officially 11 years now, yeah. how has been the, you know, the road so far? Yeah. The industry has been so, so tight. Okay. So tight. I mean, to me to say this. Like no, no problem. Region, so tight like region. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah, so it has been so hard for upcoming artists like mm -hmm. us. Especially people like me, that um, we are not really privileged to have the money to promote okay. ourselves, okay. To, um, to be signed into known record label okay. or known record label that have the money to push as okay. You know, it has been so hard for me. So I for some upcomings like me that are, say we are less privileged because there's no money. The music industry requires money. You know, that's, that's the thing you talk about. Let, yeah. let me just call you short a little bit. Rising stars should stop saying that it's not money literally to promote themselves. If you have good content, definitely you'll be recognized. I'm just sorry to call you short. You yeah, understand? Yeah, good. It should so, be so, as someone who has been in the industry for 11 years now, yeah. I think you should have a good content, isn't it? More than a good content. Good. So, what kind of genre of music you do? I do um, hip hop, I do, um, I do dance or uh, okay. rap songs, I do hardcore. Okay, hardcore. Yeah. So do you have a particular song right now that is like trending probably on yeah, social media? Yeah, sure, definitely. 
I guess should check out more. Check out more. <laughs> check out more. Yo, 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 in the next couple of years, probably two to three years from now. Yeah, my name is Crystal Blaze, so you should be expecting um, fire from me. Fire? Yeah. Like you're going to rain down fire? Yeah, I'm going to be raining down fire like Kumi. Like, all right, guys, you heard it from Crystal Blake, Jekyll Moore, Master himself. He has yeah. said it all. He has said everything we need to know about him. This guy is good. The intro he gave us already is off the hook, I dare to say. But now, guys, just watch out for this young man. He's going to be giving us something off the hook, definitely. Once again, I'm your favorite OAP, VJ Emmanuel. Thank you very much for joining us, ladies and gentlemen. And we out.